The Chief of Naval Staff, Iwok Ete Ibas, wants traditional rulers and their subjects to collaborate with the Navy in order to end pipeline vandalism, kidnapping and other crimes in the Niger Delta. His message was conveyed to the Olu of Wari and the OV of Uvi by the Flag Officer Command in Central Naval Command, Rear Admiral Seidu Garba, who inaugurated two-story buildings for the, accommodate, for, for the accommodation of staff at the Navy barracks in Efonu, Delta State. Ovi Tema George has details. In the Nigerian Navy barracks, a front stand two newly completed story buildings for the accommodation of its ratings and officers. It has become necessary because of additional recruitment into the Navy. More of such buildings are springing up in Navy barracks nationwide. The chief of the Naval Staff, in line with his strategic directive, has engaged in continuous uh, construction of buildings for accommodation in respect of ratings and officers. What you are seeing now is one of such uh, initiatives in line with our uh, anniversary program for the Nigerian Navy. Rear Admiral Saidu Garba and top officers of the Navy later visited the palace of the Olu of Wari and the Ovi of Uwe, where they conveyed a message of peace from the Chief of Naval Staff. All of us are Nigerian. Wherever you are, contribute your effort to make sure there is peace in this country. Peace is a priority in Uwe, and we do not compromise with that. We are here to complement your efforts. So when we work together, there will be peace in the land. Join your voice, my voice, to the presidency to please create job in the Niger Delta area for our boys to, to, to be engaged. Once that, once that happens, the simple problem will just evaporate. I can assure you of that. The panacea for, for peace is engagement, employment. The flag officer commanding Central Naval Command believes that traditional rulers can play pivotal roles to achieve peace and economic stability in the Niger Delta. The support of the traditional rulers towards our program now, which is the sensitization of youth and communities as well as stakeholders in ensuring that there is peace and progress in the Niger Delta. We intend to do this by going to the communities, meeting the stakeholders, and informing them of the need to ensure that we eschew violence. Ovietime George, TVC News, Wari, Delta State.